You want to edit video like this? All you have to do just stay tuned until the end of the video. You will learn how to edit an epic video with these transitions. Let's roll the intro. Hey what's up guys I hope you are having a great day welcome back to the brand new exciting video if you are new here I am Divinson here for my channel I make videos here on YouTube about filmmaking and other VFX stuff as well if you into that stuff consider subscribing and turn on the bell notification icon so you never miss a thing on my channel and also I want to thank each one of you who watch my videos and like my videos and people who thumbs down still I thank you for you guys I really appreciate your love and support and today's video I'm going to bring up some awesome three glitch transitions to make your videos epic you can use them for your short documentary vlogs or I don't mind if you're using for your short movie as well I'm going to give credits to Haman for his incredible tips on glitches so without any further ado let's get started okay inside the after effects I have all my clips in composition and all good to go I'm going to be using shift channels and wiggle position effect on this. So first I'm going to select my first two clips, right click and pre-compose them. And if you want you can keep a marker on where exactly transition to be happened. Once done I'm going to duplicate them twice and I'll find the shift color and grab it on one layer. And I'm going to keep the red channel on and green and blue full off and let's copy the same effect and paste it on second layer. On this layer I'm gonna full off red and turn on the green while the blue is on full off. And again copy the effect and paste it on top layer. And this time keep the red full off and full off the green and turn on the blue. And let's select these three layers and change the blending mode to screen just like that. And then I'm gonna grab the wiggle position from the effect panel and preset to one of these clips. And I'm going to go few keyframes backward from the marker and make a key on wiggle speed and amount to start with zero. And I'm going to bump the number up, something looks good. And I'm going to add keyframes here back, ends with zero. And then let's copy this wiggle position from this layer and paste on other two layers as well. You can adjust the value, something looks good for you. And if you are annoying with this edge flicker effect, just drag the motion tile effect above all the effect on each layer. And bump up the values of height and width. And make sure to tick the mirror edges as well. You will get the better result. On the second transition, I am going to make luma matte flicker transition into a next clip. I am going to pre-compose all these layers. And I have this glitch overlay. You can download this in my description below. I am going to drag it on this composition icon. Then let's trim this layer. And I am going to add curve effect. And adjust the curve little bit something looks good for me. And then I will make it as a black and white footage. I am going to trim this second clip somewhere here. Once done I will extend it again something like this. And let's split this layer. And keep it as overlapping to the first clip. Once done, I'm gonna place my glitch comb which I made on top of this overlapping clip. Then let's select this overlapping clip, change the layer type Luma Inverted Mat. Ta da! Looks sick! The last transition is Displacement Map, another way to make a sick transition on your video. Okay, I'm gonna place the same glitch comb on top of these both clips and trim and shortening the clip. And turn off the visibility on this glitch layer. Once done, let's make a new adjustment layer on top and name it for displacement map. And then I'm gonna apply displacement map effect on adjustment layer and change the displacement map layer to this glitch comp. And by tweaking values of horizontal and vertical values, you can get the sick glitch transition on this clip. And I'm gonna trim the adjustment layer as well. Ta da! Looks pretty sick. Let's play the final output. Well there you have it, 3 glitch transitions that you can use for your next video. Let me know in the comments below which one is your favorite. And this is pretty much it guys from today's video. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and got something out of it. If you did, hit the like button for me. If you didn't like it, hit the like button for me. Also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, links in the description box. I'll see you guys on next one. Until then, peace.